Good day, my beautiful listeners. Uh, as the 2023 election approaches, uh, so many politicians are running. Elders that are looking for what is not lost. Uh, why Buhari will not endorse uh, Tinubu as successor uh, come 2023? Yes, this is the headline. The uh, comrade uh, Olufemi Aduwo is the permanent uh, representative of the Center for Convention on Democratic Integrity, uh, CCDI, for the United States. Oh, sorry, United Nations, uh, United States, United Nations. Uh, they are both uh, working in the end. As it is, I would say, uh, Aduo, uh, who is also the president of the Rights uh, Monitoring Group, RMG. Mm, that is the right, uh, Women's Rights Monitoring Group. And also in the interview, speaks on the state of the nation. The 2023 uh, presidential election and insecurity in the country, among other issues, uh, while led by the uh, reports of the uh, event, uh, the new year uh, commenced on a rather high note in politics when former governor of uh, Lagos State, Bolame Tinumbu, went to meet the president uh, to declare his intention for the presidency. How do you see this? Uh, it, is n it is normal and it is allowed uh, any where and anybody can contest if he or she is within the uh, stipulated age. However, it is one thing that have uh, that okay, one thing uh, to have intention, I know, but it's another thing uh, for the intention to materialize. Uh, that is what it is. I will you know, read again. It is normal and it is allowed. Anybody can uh, contest if he or she is within the stipulated uh, age. However, it is one thing to have an uh, intention, uh, but it is another uh, thing uh, for the intention to materialize or materialize uh, thereabout. I heard uh, Tenobu said uh, it is a lifetime ambition for him to become uh, the president, but he forgot that we have some kingmakers when it comes to uh, the issue of presidency in Nigeria. Uh, some of them are not even politicians and they are not uh, even up to 20, uh, and there is always f uh, and also foreign interest. Uh, for me, he, he is entitled to his ambition and uh, personally, and also his personality. I have, uh, I have nothing uh, against uh, Bolamet Tinubu that is coming from a duo, uh, but I think it is another joke. He has taken too far because I don't know exactly what he wants to tell Nigerians uh, that he has done. In other claims, uh, when you want to be uh, the servant leader, uh, yes, uh, you submit uh, yourself uh, to the law of the society for example uh, the law says an individual cannot uh, carry more than five million naira a bullion, a bullion van that uh, usually carries a uh, 1.5 billion naira uh, two of it entered into uh, okay two of it entered uh, yes into his uh, compound in the evening of the uh, 2019 election uh, the whole world uh, saw it and it was so myopic to say he could take his money the way uh, he wanted. He is not above the law of the land. Uh, these are the issues. Uh, people will ask questions about how he produced and uh, removed people from position, uh, which means he is not a Democrat. Uh, as the governor of Lagos State, uh, he removed uh, two of his deputies uh, within eight years of his rule. He removed uh, Koforola uh, Buckner and uh, Femi Pedro. And he says he is a Democrat. Uh, for me, somebody like Tinubu cannot uh, do anything. Okay? Uh, what he has been telling people on carrying uh, Buhari along is a fluke uh, and saying he, he will build uh, on Buhari's legacy. Uh, which legacy is he talking about? Uh, he should come and tell us uh, how he is going to fight insecurity, how he is going to create uh, employment and uh, others. On the issue of uh, his character, uh, which people have been saying a lot about, uh, he should come out and clear himself. Uh, he should come out and tell us uh, how he got his money. Uh, we need a, a, a unifier as the next president. Uh, he should also understand what people have been saying that uh, Nigeria no be Lagos. Wow. Uh, like what this person said earlier, says a uh, king may uh, uh, don't you know become king all this uh, you mentioned uh, still can't uh, negate the fact that he has the capacity uh, like I said earlier uh, there are king makers uh, who are mostly not politicians both uh, they are important Tinubu says he has the capacity uh, within the way uh, he removed the former uh, Lagos uh, governor state uh, state uh, I call me Ambody, yes, uh, former governor of Lagos State. And also, uh, he could not uh, face uh, the superior idea uh, that that the superior idea of the man had. Okay, that, that is a sign of low self esteem. Whenever any argument ensues, uh, he takes a bow and uh, 
that is the man that says uh, he has the capacity uh, where is the capacity well i could remember you know from the interview uh, he graced uh, i believe uh, he was shying away from so many questions okay like uh, this question is going to a duo uh, you will agree that the man has lately attained a national figure in politics he midwived uh, okay he midwife uh, Buhari's coming to power in 2015. Uh, what this is, this simply means is that uh, he 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 is the national leader and uh, of APC and the, uh, the platform which uh, Buhari uh, came into power. Uh, you made a mistake. I have observed uh, elections in Nigeria since uh, 2003. Buhari has been getting his 10 to 11 million votes since 2023, uh, 20, 2003 rather. Uh, but he didn't win three elections with that. Okay, uh, in the 2015 election, uh, those five uh, PDP governors that joined APC, uh, yes, uh, their states gave Buhari 3.5 million votes and Buhari was uh, able to defeat uh, Jonathan uh, with 2.5 million uh, votes uh, without those uh, votes from the five uh, PDP governors. Buhari couldn't have won that election. Uh, Lagos State, uh, where Tinubu is based, was able to give uh, Buhari only about 600,000 uh, votes. Uh, there were a lot of uh, factors that worked against uh, Jonathan and PDP in 2015, and it was uh, capitalized upon. Yes, uh, this same Tinubu condemned uh, Buhari before, uh, saying that he is not a Democrat. Uh, but when they were looking for somebody to use and which they believe is uh, sellable, uh, they approached uh, Buhari. <laughs> Okay, there is another question I've been thrown here to do. I says, do you see Buhari supporting Tinubu's ambition? Hmm. Well, uh, Buhari cannot support him for many reasons. Uh, when Buhari was the head of state, he didn't understand the politics of religion in Nigeria, and uh, he appointed Babatunde Idiagbo. Uh, definitely, Babatunde Idiagbo was also a Muslim as his deputy, and these were some of the things that worked against uh, him uh, that he couldn't last up to a year as head of state. Uh, look at it today. Tinubu is a Muslim. Uh, we may be pretending, but uh, we are more uh, polarized on religious uh, issues, and it is a very uh, sensitive matter, and uh, the problem problem uh, virtually you know disturbing the nigerian nation uh, yes uh, i would say the, uh, the religion um, political religion i don't know where it goes uh, that uh, you know a notion from uh, whereby i believe uh, christianity is a way of life and uh, islam i, I wouldn't know uh, it's still also a way of life so that shouldn't you know be a yastic uh, to you know uh, govern nigeria or rather i would say i would believe uh, that is uh, a a distraction uh, from whoever is ruling uh, like the uh, UN, united states uh, yes i would say their policy is based on god and is set very very well on the platform of uh, truth yes uh, which uh, it says a uh, democracy is the government of the people for the people and by the people yes are we observing democracy in nigeria uh, because uh, those who gave up gave us uh, independence and uh, they gave us a uh, a parliamentary system of governance, or rather, I would say uh, that was what we know uh, how to do. But as it is, uh, we believe uh, that they gave us open end and uh, we grabbed uh, democracy. And now, truly, the question now says uh, for those that are viewing and listening, I will ask the last question Is democracy the government of the people for the people and by the people? Yes, I would like you to share that in the comment section. Let's, you know, deliberate on this. Yes, Etinumbu. Uh, is going nowhere. Do you agree? Or oh, Tinubu is going somewhere. Let's see how it goes.